What's up guys, welcome back to the John Q channel. In today's video, I wanna show you what you get inside a Stopbox Pro by Stopbox USA package, so let's get into it. Now, if you haven't been on the internet and you don't follow guns, well then, you don't really know what I'm talking about. But if you do, you know that Stopbox has been all over the internet, all over social media, and they're taking the gun safety box system world by storm, right? So here's the thing. I have a right here stop box pro another I have two boxes here and just full disclaimer stop box did send this out to me for review for testing to put on the channel and to make videos if you want to get this for yourself there will be a discount code JQ10 for 10% off they also have deals where you can buy one and get one for free or something like that I don't really know but you can use that code JQ10 at your disposal all right so what do we get with the stop box pro right so we have instant reliable access we have rapid access finger code lock no battery and no electronics, which is great. Uh, it's got glass reinforced polycarbonate ABS, 81 combinations of padlock compatible, or it's padlock compatible, and it's also made in the US, which is what we like. So here we go. When we open the box, what do we get? Stop Box Pro. And of course, simple instructions on how to use and store and unlock your Stop Box. And of course, it comes with a lifetime warranty. So here's the thing right out of the box, like anybody can open this. All you have to do is this. It's got, it comes with a uh, combination that's one here with the fingers, just these three fingers, and then you open. When you open the box, you get some more of the combo locks here and more instructions on how to actually set that up and change it. So the thing is, here's what's key. What you wanna do is you wanna apply pressure down on the box as you have your fingers on the combo here, right? So you do this, apply pressure, and then do that and unbox it just like that. We'll do it again, right? And then close it up like normal. So put your hand on it, fingers on the padlocks, push down and then push up. So it's really that simple. Now here's the thing. Um, I get a lot of questions or not questions, but comments literally saying, Johnny, this is, this is not a safe. Like children are still gonna be able to reach it. A child can get into it, you can use a tool, a pry bar to open it up. And here's what I say. Why are your children trying to get into your safe? Like you should, you should, number one, be storing your guns away from children. Like that's just literally common sense. Now, I'm not saying that this is going to replace your gun safe, that you use a code to get in or a key or any sort of combination like that. That's not what I'm saying. I'm saying that this is a very good, viable option for someone who is traveling with a pistol or any other gear that they might want. You can put this into your truck, into your car, uh, in your bedroom, in your closet, wherever you wanna keep a pistol. I think it's a very good option. Like I have one of these in my bedroom. And like I said, it does take practice to get it open, but again, apply hand pressure. And the combination out of the box is thumb, finger, this finger and you lift just like that it's open now of course if you want to change the combination there are instructions in the box on how to do so it's very easy but for the most part i like this combo because myself and my wife know that combo my kids do not know that combo i've tried to get my kids to open up this box and they can't get in so the whole thing where kids can get into the box yeah well they shouldn't be able to get in the box because they shouldn't be able to reach us in the first place right so that's the thing like there are a lot of cool companies and brands coming out with things like this. And it's really cool to see a brand and a company come out with something that's very, number one, useful, and B, something that's so easily like able to be accessed without any thought whatsoever. Because in other systems, you have to have your thumbprint and you have, like I'm thinking about uh, my blacksmith safe that I have to put my thumbprint on and have to like, if, if I don't get my thumb directly on that thing and if it doesn't beep, it's gonna beep twice and I can't get in. And if someone's in my house and I have to get to my gun and I go to my blacksmith safe and like I'm full of adrenaline, like, hey, I need my gun, I need my gun, it's not working. Well, I've lost precious time that I can't get to my gun. Where this, you know, practicing it, you know, just even doing it fast now, I'm easily able to get in there so quickly, like, if I mess up there, I can go quickly back to it. And that's probably something that would happen in a scenario where like, I just woke up from a dead sleep and I hear something going on. 
Like I'm looking, I know where the box is, but because of the mechanics of how this works, my muscle memory, it's gonna go straight to those three buttons, get my gun and then go to work. So yeah, I mean, is this something that you should buy? I mean, maybe. If you're looking for something that's going to be uh, compact and useful and make your life easier, yeah, probably you should. But if you don't want to, then don't buy it. Like no one's forcing you. I just, uh, I feel like this is gear that I use all the time. And I wanna make sure that you guys know that there's other options on the market like the Stopbox Pro uh, that could help you get your firearm quicker and potentially even save your life one day. God forbid that never happens to you, but it's a good viable option. I've seen people store these in their trucks, in their homes, in their garage, uh, under their seat, in their car. I mean, you can store this anywhere. It's basically like, like a little book. I mean, not so little, obviously, but like you can store this anywhere and it's TSA compliant. I mean, and it's just fine. And if you want, you can put a padlock through here. That'll be just fine. So like there's ways of securing this even more, but for the most part, if you want something that's lightweight, that's going to be able to travel with you, then this might be a good option for you and your family. I know some people that have bought like literally four at a time to keep in their home, one at the office, one in the garage and one in their car. Like that's pretty wild, but like people are doing it because nowadays you just never know what's going to happen and when you might need something like this to again, quickly access your gun in a time of need. So yeah, and as you can see here, I'm storing a full staccato P with a Surefire X300. So a pretty big gun. I can also store a flashlight, a knife. What else? I mean, that that's a lot of gear. Like that's kind of like an everyday setup right there, right? So. If you want, go put this in your car, in your backpack, wherever you want. And again, quickly access it just like that. So there you guys go. Like I said before, if you want to get this Stopbox Pro, uh, use code JQ10 at stopboxusa.com. There's my beef brush, probably take a couple shots here. Uh, you know, just have it, you just gotta do it. So yeah, go to Stopbox Pro or go to stopboxusa.com, use code JQ10 for 10% off your entire order. Anyway, hope you guys like this video. Just kind of give you an insight on the box itself and how it could be useful for you. So thanks for watching uh, and I'll see you in the next Johnny Q video. Peace.